checklist co almost cost one woman thousands of dollars, but she caught the crook just in time. Fox 42's Maureen Wirtz has her story and more on how you can avoid scams and keep your money safe. It was an ad Melissa Kyle wishes she never placed. We thought we did our, our homework enough to where, you know, we didn't think this was going to be this type of situation. Kyle was trying to sell this car on Craigslist, a 1984 Buick Grand National. I spoke to him on the phone about three times. She got an offer via email from a man named Dr. Richard Rowe. He said he wanted to buy the car as a surprise for his stepson. With him explaining himself as being a man in the military and being overseas, we just thought maybe he didn't have time to come into Omaha to actually look at the vehicle. After a lot of back and forth, Roe finally sent this check. He thought he was going to get us to cash a check and send money back to him. When Melissa got the check, she noticed it was made out for $7,500. They were only asking 5000 for the car. With the check being such a large amount of money, that's what you know was majorly suspicious. Kyle said she had the bank see if the check was legitimate. It turned out the bank was real. But the routing number was not. The last email was, okay, send this amount of money to this to have the shipping for the vehicle done. And we knew right then and there this was not a legitimate offer. She says she's not sure what they'll do with this car, but she is sure she won't be posting any more ads on Craigslist. Maureen Wirtz, Fox 42 News.